we're getting ready to go to the Red River Gorge to do some winter camping. And I just picked up this tough box. Um, originally, it's going to be used for um, a solar power box, which I'm going to be building. I'm waiting on the batteries and the converters and the parts. But until then, I want to go ahead and see how much stuff I can pack into this um, because I do want to um, think about buying a couple more of these boxes for storage. Um, take a look how big this box is. I mean, I have a ton of gear in here. Um, I have all my stickers um, for my sponsors. That's uh, Moose Knuckle and CVF and all the discount codes. But um, right now, what, what I'm really impressed with is the amount of stuff that I can put inside the IP65 waterproof rated box. It's got these really cool Molly panel sidings. So I got plans for those. Now this is um, their stackable box. So that little latch right there is so you can stack other boxes to it. And the handles are beefy. Let me tell you, I love that when you lift those handles, you get this nice thud and they're very solid. So I got my air pump for my rooftop tent in there. I got some recovery gear in here from my Ollie gear. So I have their full strap in here. Um, down in the bottom, I also have their um, uh, strap that's their tree saver. I have the um, winch stuff in here as well, a tool bag roll, the pump for my air mattress, a rag um, to clean the condensation out of the tent if I have some. And then underneath there, is a full tool roll that literally goes from here to here. Guys, this box is awesome. Look how well it packs, even with my refrigerator in there. And with the seats down, I have tons of space. I could literally put another one of these boxes sideways or stack them because look how flat the lid is. Um, another feature that I really like about this is that it's flat and it kind of goes down and then it locks. So if you look at the Milwaukee ones, they have those little places for the counter locks and the top of your box, it's not flat. This will be flat. So I could probably stack maybe one more in there and then their little half system. And then I have a complete uh, removable storage space for the Bronco that's lightweight. If you remember, I had my wood box back here. I did sell that. It was a little bit heavy um, for the Bronco. And then when I was off-roading, it was bottoming out. Um, but what I'm gonna do is convert everything to these tough built boxes. I am absolutely in love with this thing. 89 bucks, you can get it at Lowe's. It looks awesome in your Bronco, right next to a cooler. Check them out, guys. Tough built large box. Go out and grab you a few. Here's some details about it. High impact, reversible, uh, reinforced steel lid. Like you can tell too, this thing is, is very solid. Um, has that waterproof gasket across the top. I like that. Let's just zoom back out here and put this back. And then when you um, close this lid, the cool thing about the lid is how it locks into place. Let me move some stuff around so I can close this. All right, watch this. And then it nice clips down love it absolutely love it and you have handles on this side that side right here and on the back and they also have um, like a cutting board or like a measuring board that can go on top of this so like if you want it completely flat um, it's got like a real pretty oak wood top on it it's pretty cool all right, guys, head out to Lowe's, get you one of these. 
So if you turn it sideways, again, I mean, the, the possibilities to have so many stacked boxes on here is gonna be crazy. I even have room to um, put other gear on the side. Um, you know, if I wanna put maybe two of these together, um, the cool thing is, is I'm gonna have that complete Molly system stacked all the way up, you know, to strap additional things down. So I gotta, I'm gonna put my diesel heater in here and see how much space I have. So you can see I just turned the uh, tough built box on its side. Everything in there is packed really nice and nothing's like shuffling around. But look at this. I put my diesel heater in this container um, just because there is some fuel left over in that and I don't want it sloshing around. That's my portable built box. But big cooler. The tough belt box, diesel heater, still have tons of room to put things. And look how nice and square everything is. Like if I have to keep continuing to stack this out, I can, uh, but make sure to uh, like and subscribe. We're gonna be building that box to be a battery inverter, solar power for the tent. Uh, like and subscribe, share this with your friends. We'll see you on the next one.